हेलो एंड वेलकम एवरी वन ऑन माई चैनल आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट इन योर लाइफ यू आर कीपिंग द गुड स्पिरिट ऑफ योर हेल्थ एंड हैप्पीनेस एंड थैंक्स फॉर स्टॉपिंग बाई एंड लुकिंग एट माई चैनल एंड हियरिंग दिस ब्यूटिफुल वीडियो आउट सो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट समथिंग विच इज वेरी क्लोज टू एवरीबडीज लाइफ दैट इज हाउ डू दे लुक हाउ डू दे अपियर are they looking good enough i mean like this is equally very very true for both the gender irrespective of any gender you are you are men you are children you are a old person or like since you are aging you don't uh, think a lot about it but still i mean like irrespective of the gender you are in everybody is very conscious about are they looking gorgeous or not and many times you know uh, you spend a lot of especially when you are in the teenage years you spend uh, you spend a lot of time in front of the mirror like trying to accentuate yourself like how do you look and also you do a lot of things by which you should be properly presentable enough because one it enhances your confidence secondly you also feel good about yourself and there are many factors but most importantly everybody want to look amazingly and also feel amazingly now there are two things in this video i would like to say looking amazingly and feeling amazingly this might sound like it's very same thing but uh, tell me let me tell you very honestly that these are these are not the same things looking amazing could be the external things you have added on for example the perfume that you have applied on you the kind of clothes you have put on the accessories that you are wearing all of these thing uh, would appear to your external appearances to your looks but when it comes to feeling amazing that is something a lot of people don't delve much into it like what it is like feeling amazing for example you have worn your favorite dress okay uh, and you go out and you ask somebody who is close to you obviously why would you ask from the entire world and they say no no this is not looking good just wear some other thing okay and you just went changed and you came out and you know now you are sulking inside you are not feeling good because actually you saw yourself even and you really liked that you were in that particular dress so uh, there is a sense of validation and since you were not validated you were not approved by the person you asked with and then you changed now there could be many reasoning for this for you know there could be many reasoning because maybe you have a, want to impress that other person maybe the uh, you know whatever uh, you know suggestion that person had to give for you it really matters wait i'll just change the orientation of this camera is it fine cuz i am sensing that it is not placed correctly ha huh. wait yeah so there could be many reasons to it okay uh so uh, you have asked also the other person means that their response what is their approach towards how you have dressed up means a lot to you now coming forward okay um we have discussed already about looking amazingly it could be accentuated by the accessories you wear the kind of clothes you wear and so on and so forth so i would be focusing now to something which is deeper that is feeling amazing see a lot of confidence come from within okay a lot of confidence come from the person you are for example no matter your shape and sizes if you have accepted yourself for who you are uh, for example you have not pushed yourself to the limits of perfecting yourself but you have now accepted yourself to your flaws to the goodness to the you know to everybody has the strength as well as weakness there is nobody on this planet who has just the strength there is combination of strength and weaknesses which means there is combination of good and the bad qualities and once you have embraced it all you have embraced your own very self you have now worked for you know acknowledging your personal identity 
you would definitely feel very very empowered enriched and it would enhance your confidence now what you are externally wearing is to accentuate the entire aura rather than making you believe what you have not known or you are not aware about so it really helps you when you know yourself from within so the confidence comes from within so now even if you wear that pink dress and go and the person you have asked says so now you can say ki okay that dress is good but i equally feel very good over here and uh, yeah i want to wear it so you have asked that person but uh, if you don't want to change that you would still be very confident enough and wear that it would not <laughs> give rise to conflicts but yes it would make you and even if you don't feel like asking you would not go and ask your internal confidence has a lot of role to play when you are confident outside and see a person can uh, hone that uh, skill of being confident from various ways by you know equipping with a lot of resources but once you have really worked on your internal confidence it becomes it becomes a short short solution for a better life because you you are now very much aware about yourself so you know what actually triggers you what actually is good for you what you are not and you would act, uh, work on the betterment of your own very self and when you are yourself to the fullest so you would be very much reflecting the positive uh, positivity from yourself and you would be confident so from this video i would like to just say that try to seek within who you are as a person who you would like yourself to vision and what are your shortcomings and what are your strength because you would be having both just measure and weigh them what is in plenty what do you want to improve what do you look forward in your life and yes then external beauties is definitely a treat to the eye but when you are very sure with your internal beauties you are at peace with your own self and even that matters a lot i hope you enjoyed watching this video thanks for listening to me bye bye and take care